80 miles away from Arthur's alleged burial in Glastonbury is Winchester Hall. It contains something large, wooden and round. So that's it? Come on, you know what I'm talking about. That's a big old round table. And at the top <laughs> of it, there's a painting of a man sitting on a throne and it says King Arthur. It does, it does, which is a handy sign that it's meant to be King Arthur. Is it the round table? Well, it's the closest thing we've got. It's medieval. It was made by King Edward I in perhaps 1275. He had it made for a great celebration for the betrothal of one of his daughters. And these events were called round tables, ah. where there'd be a tournament jousting, um, knights riding in the lists and ladies watching. Although King Edward commissioned the table in the first place, another famous Arthur fan, Henry VIII, jumped on the bandwagon 300 years later repainting it and adding a Tudor rose. These great English kings wanted to connect with the round table's symbolic values. Arthur's knights were so wonderful. They were all so courtly and chivalric and perfect that they had the round table made so that none of them would ever feel that they were of lesser status than the others. 